Wow, that did not take long guys. I just literally uploaded a video and now the treasury department just came out with the second update for April 10, 2020. So this update is for you guys who filed your 2018 or 2019 taxes, but did not provide an account information. Let me read it to you. This is what just came out literally right now. The US Department of Treasury and the IRS will launch the Get My Payment app next week. So instead of the end of the month, like they said, it will be next week. They will be launching an app called Get My Payment app. This app will be available from the IRS website. You can download it from a computer, a tablet, or any phone. This app does not need to be downloaded from any app stores. From this app, you will be able to track your payment status by entering your social security number, your date of birth, and your mailing address. Like I told you guys, this thing is an evolving process. It's constantly updating. And uh, today we got two updates. Please subscribe to the channels, guys. We're the only channel on YouTube here, guys, who's bringing you up to the minute update about the stimulus package in five minutes or less. So please subscribe so you don't miss any of our next videos. Here's the information you're going to need to sign up and enter your payment information so you can get your money as quickly as possible when this app come out next week, guys. Your most recent tax return. So they can verify who you are and allow you to put your banking information so you can receive your money. So you're going to look for your 1040. The first thing you're going to look for is your AGI, which is your adjusted gross income. Your adjusted gross income will be on line 8B. So write that down. Next thing you're going to need is your refund amount, is your overpayment, which is your refund amount. That will be on line 20 from your 1040 form. Write that down. If you did not get a refund, if you owe money, that will be on line 23, which is the amount you owe. Is either you got a refund, which is on line 20, or you had to pay back. If you had to pay back, it's line 23. So you need these three informations, guys. So you need to write down these three informations in order for you to sign up for this app when it comes out next week. I'll definitely do a step-by-step -step to show you guys how to do it. But for now, just get ready. So look for these informations right now from your most recent tax returns so you can have them ready when the app comes out next week so we can do it together as quickly as possible so you can get your money and again guys this is for people who already filed their 2018 or 2019 taxes but did not provide a bank account information in other words you got to check in the mail or you got a debit card somebody just brought that to my attention a lot of people elected to get debit cards instead of checks so if you did get a check or you got a debit card download this app next week when it comes out so you can update your information so you can get paid as quickly as possible. If you don't have a bank account, the first check won't be coming out until the beginning of May, until September. They're starting from the bottom, which means you can be waiting five months before you get your check. So if you can, try to get a free account from your local credit union or your local bank, because uh, that's the only way to get this money as quickly as possible. So this is the second update from the IRS and the Treasury today, April 10th, 2020. As always, guys, thank you again for watching. If this is your first time here, my name is Paul with Sunset Realty, and I would love to have you as a subscriber, so please subscribe so you don't miss any of our next videos. Again, guys, have a nice weekend. Thank you.